to one hour of top musical performances from a celebrity of stars. We've got Lou Baker, we've got Boys and we've got the Benga Boys and we've got Enrique Iglesias. But first off to kick yeah. things off for us this morning, the band have already had a top 10 hit with their debut single, Friends Forever. There's no better way to introduce them than in their native tongue. So please say hello, bonjour and guten tag to the Thunderbugs. <laughs> Teens get their second hit, Super Trooper, at number 20. Will Smith falls to 19 on the Saturday chart with Will 2K. The coolest man in pop, JK, popped into CD UK for a chat last week, and King for a Day is new at 18. Fall at the 17, keep on moving, it's five. Taken from the cause Unplugged Radio is a new entry this week at 16. Lolly's down to 15 with Rockin' Robin and Big Boys Don't Cry. Mess with them at your peril, Liz Kerry and Natasha, alias Atomic Kitten, debut at number 14 with Right Now. Robbie Williams, 4, 7 to 13. Macy Gray falls from the top 10 after nine weeks. I Try is at number 12. And that's the way it is, taken from Celine Dion's greatest hits album, is a new entry at 11. Well, there you are, there's the first bit of the chart, but do you want to catch up with the worldwide news? Do you want to know who the new Mariah Carey is? And do you want to know the latest gossip from the TLC camp? Do you want to know who's the new star of The Simpsons? Well, if you do, do you? Do you want to? Do we? Yes, well, why don't we check out this week's CD UK News? The Spice Girls are back with a Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, there's the news. But how do you fancy taking a look at some videos, choosing your favourite one, ringing up for it, and seeing it in full at the end of the show? Fancy that? All right. Well, you can with this week's People's Choice. Here are this week's choices. Bewitch finished their first arena tour this week, which starred another Lynch sister, Naomi. She's in one of their support groups, Buffalo G. I Shall Be There is their sixth single and features the Ladysmith Black Mambazo. I shall be This is the work of a comedy writer, a member of KLF and Fat Les. The song was remixed by the Spice Girls producer and is another track to feature a very annoying mobile phone. In 99 was originally a number two hit back in 1982. It comes from his double album of the same name and was produced, written, and arranged by Prince. Not the artist, not a symbol, not Roger, but Prince. And you can see part two of his CDK interview very soon. There you go, that's the People's Choice. Pick your favourite video and vote for it, and we'll play it at the end of the show. Now then, these next four have had three top five hits so far this year, and this looks as though it could be their fourth. With a brand new Ben member, this is their brand new single from The Benga Boys. The Benga Boys there, and Kiss When The Sun Don't Shine, featuring new Benga Boy York. And it's another surefire hit for the guys, I'm sure. Now then, something a little bit special for you from a man who this week forked out 50 grand to ITV's Pass the Parcel appeal just so underprivileged kids can have something special at Christmas. Well, that man is George Michael and this is him in October at NetAid performing the brilliant Brother Can You Spare a Dime? Can you lend us a quid? No, you still owe us four quid from last week. <laughs> 
Bother. Right, anyway, we've got prizes to give away on this week's show. We'd like to say well done to Ruth Kilpatrick from Newcastle, who won last week's prize. There was uh, no bias there. She won it fair and square. I was going to say. from the same day. She I won it. You. She's got the prize. I think there's favouritism going on no, there. No, no, she's got them. They're anyway, out. let's move on, shall we? Yes, indeed. This, this morning you can win this Westlife book and signed artwork, and they've signed it there for oh, you. Oh, look at that. There you go. They've signed, signed it and everything. It. And also the video to match as well. The video, all the artwork. Right. We've got all these signed albums. We've got, look, Banger Boys, 18. Melanie C, all signed, Boys on sign, and they were Thunderbug signed as well, all of them. We've also got the S Club 7 long form video. And we've got this lovely jacket given to us by Bridget from Thunderbugs. I don't, I don't think it's leather though. Give us you a know. Twirl. She wore that in the French Forever video. That can be yours oh, with that was all so the hard. other stuff if you can answer this question. Oh. What country do Tom Jones and Keris Matthews come from? Is it A, Australia, B, Iceland, or C, Wales? Wales. Call us on 9014, 94094. Calls cost 50 pence, but please get permission. You can win everything you see there this morning. There's still lots to come, including... Tom and Keris will be chatting to us live in the studio. We'll go behind the scenes of the new S Club 7 video. And Enrique Iglesias will be in the house. Plus, this million seller will be this. It's Mr. Lou Bigger, everybody. <laughs> Lou, welcome back to uh, See the UK. Now then, massive summer smash, Mambo number five. Can you tell us how many countries it actually got to number one in? Oh, my. Or have you lost count? <laughs> <laughs> must be about 30. 30? 30 countries. Really? Yeah. Blimey, that's a lot of countries, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, in, the, in it, you, you, you go on about all the girls and stuff, all your girlfriends, a little bit of, of uh, Doris and, and all that. <laughs> and now in, in the new song, you go on about all the countries. Yeah, I just ran out of names. Are you going to land yourself in hot water soon, aren't you, mister? Yeah, I just ran out of names. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta but go with countries. You know? You're going to be performing for us a little bit later on, aren't you? Yeah, uh, my new single is I Got A Girl. It's, it comes out on Monday, so uh, let's tune and in. And we'll be, we'll be seeing that live in the studio. Lou Bega sticking around. Why don't you? We'll see you after the break. <laughs> Welcome back to CDK right here on ITV every Saturday. Still to come this morning's show, we've got Lou Bega in the house. S Club 7, we've got Tom and Keris and of course the all important Saturday chart, number one. But before all that, a band who were narrowly pipped for the number one spot last week. They're currently on a massive UK tour but have found time to pop into the CDK studio. Here with their new single, Every Day I Love You. Please welcome Boys Home. New at 10, Lauren Hill and Bob Marley. Turn the lights down low. Yeah, I want to give you some good. The Spice Girls begin their roundhouse tour in Manchester tonight and Northern Star from Melanie C is at number 9. If I could turn back the hands of time, he's down to 8. Martine McCutcheon climbs a place on our chart with her Children in Need single, Love Me and Talking in Your Sleep. And down one place to six for Alice DJ, back in my life. Now then, I've been joined by not one Welsh singing superstar, but two. Please give, give a massive round of applause for Tom Jones and Karis Matthews. Yeah. Welcome back to see you here, the pair of you. Thank you. Tom, last time you were down here, it was just before the Reload, the US album, came yeah, out. That's right. Since then, it's gone platinum here in the UK. Yep. It's sold over a million all over the world. Yes. You must be absolutely delighted. I am. Yeah? <laughs> Good. <laughs> <laughs> did, you, did you kind of predict that success? Or did well, you... no, you never know. You just try, you do the best you can, and you hope that people will like it. You yeah. Know, that's, that's all you can do, really. Now, of course, the, the new song, Baby It's Call Outside, is from the album, The Jerk with Keris. Yeah. How did you come to get involved in the whole thing, Keris? Um... I'm not really sure. <laughs> I can't remember. <laughs> yes, you are. Tell the no, truth. No, all right. It's the truth. It's the ballad of Tom Jones. We did a, I did a duet with Space. Yeah. Uh, that's about two years ago, maybe now. Two years. And you saw the video, didn't you? I did. And um, you fancy the frocks in it, didn't you? That's right. So you saw it, you'd ask me, and you'd ask me where I got the frocks from. Exactly. So, um, no, we, I just love his voice. Right. I love all this, how the style of Tom singing and everything. And, and you know, he asked me to do this song. And it's, uh, Have you always been a big fan of Tom? Um, Tell the truth. No. No, <laughs> no. no. Of course I have. Of course I have. Hell yes. Why Baby It's Called Outside? Why that particular song? Um, well, I had about three or four different songs to uh, 
to play the caddies, which I did. They were dreadful. And the other, <laughs> were they? the other three were awful. So she said, the only good one there is this one. No, she said that she, that she liked Baby It's Cold Outside. Right. And uh, we, we listened to the Ray Charles Betty Carter uh, mm -hmm. version. And um, I said, great, because I was glad she picked that one because it's a proper duet yeah. with a lot of songs that you, you, you make duets are not written as duets, mm. you know, they're written for one person to sing. Yeah. So then you've got to chop it up and see who sings what. But this one was actually written as a duet. Right. You know, there are two parts to it. So uh, it, was, it was great. <laughs> we, so all we had to do was sing, uh, Carrie sang the boys' part and I sang the girls' part. Right. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> <it's the> <laughs> and the video as well, we've got the, we're going to see the video uh, just in just a minute. The yeah. video is great. Thank you. And there's a real chemistry on, on screen with the, with the pair of you. <laughs> it really is. I mean, was, was it, was it, that's how good we danced together. Right. Is, was it easy to turn that off when the camera stopped? Was it turn easy it off. To, to turn that turn kind off. of camera? Turn, turn it off when the camera stopped. We haven't turned it off yet. No, it. It. <laughs> Move it, moving swiftly along. Is, uh, is, is this a conscious effort for the Christmas number one then? Is, no. Are, are, you, are you going to no, up we against want number Cliff? 31. Number 31. 31 is what we're aiming for, isn't it? <laughs> is, that, is, that what, <laughs> is that what you want? Is it, is it up against Cliff? Are you trying to knock Cliff off? No, no, I'm trying to knock Cliff off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not the number one spot, honestly. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, we just hope that uh, that people like it, that's all. Right. You know, it's up to the people what, what number it gets to. <laughs> right. Well, uh, thank you for coming down and, and joining us uh, once again. We've got some great prizes as well for, for the trunk, haven't we? We've got, uh, obviously, you don't know nothing about this. We've got some great jackets, reload jackets, which we're giving away, and you're going to oh, sign yeah, it for us. I, I presumed it was yours, oh. but we're going to give it away anyway. You're going to sign them for us. Okay. But uh, we're going to see the video for Baby It's Cold Outside. But before that, please give your appreciation to Mr. Tom Jones and Paris Matthews. <laughs> and here's the video for the brand new single, Baby It's Cold Outside. <coughs> it's cold outside. Oh, what a, what a tough song, what a duo, we like that. You know, that could well be Christmas number one, such a good song, but uh, another band who opened for Christmas number one, that coveted spot, are S Club 7. They've got a double A side out at the moment, uh, a side A, or if you like to call it, is uh, Two in a Million, and the other side A is You're My Number One. They filmed uh, Two in a Million video in Los Angeles, and the other one down here in London, and that's where CDUK caught up with them to find out all the action. <laughs> S Club 7 there, and both those A-sides are out on December the 13th. And S Club also feature on It's Only Rock and Roll, so a double chance to be Christmas number one. Could the be. The jammy beggars. Could be. Now then, this summer was certainly the summer of salsa with a load of Latin tracks filling the chart. And this guy looks set to continue where he left off with his number one smash. This is Hey I Got A Girl. Please welcome Mr. Lou Vega. <laughs> Stop bragging, the girl went everywhere. I've just got the one. Anyway, uh, that's that's take the second album taken from a little bit of Mambo, which is out next week. Prizes, you want prizes? Well, it's we've coming, got him. It's coming to the Panto season and cat. He's behind you. Who? <laughs> a cutout of uh, Enrique Iglesias. So he is. <laughs> you can win that. You can win that. That's the prize pie. What else we got? That was a cracking one, Dan. I didn't is. know he did that. Uh, we've got the boys' own box set. That's all the singles ever, ever, all ever. All of ever, them. Ever, they can win ever. all of them. Good prize. We've got this T-shirt given to us by Melanie C. Little bit of merchandise there. And we've also got this Jamiro quite signed single by JK. He's a very now, cool man. Now he doesn't man. say many things, you know. He so, so that's a good prize. Very cool man. All right. Right. Okay, you can win all that if you answer this question. With you. Oh, well, they're not. Oh. Nah, carry on. Which country do Tom and Keris come from? Is it A, Australia, B, Iceland, or C, Wales? If you think you know the answer, then give us a call on 09014 940 940. Calls cost no more than 50p to bargain. 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 Thanks very much, Kat. No props. And Ant. In the final part of CDK today, Enrique Iglesias is in the house. We've got new music in Hot Shots and, of course, the CDK Saturday chart number one. Can Cliff make it three weeks at the top? Find out in three minutes. See you after the break. Welcome back to CDK, your weekly dose of musical medicine. Nice one, Ant. I'll see what you've done there. Still to come this morning there, who will be our Saturday chart number one? Will it be a Wham Do Project? Will it be Cliff Richard for a second week? Or can the artful dodger artfully dodge his way to the top of the pile? Find out here in the next 20 minutes. But before that, we still need your votes for the People's Choice. <laughs> 09015-660-101 for Bewitched. Just add 102 for the Solid Gold Chartbusters. 
103 for Prince. Well, there you go. Bewitched are currently in the lead, so if you want to change that, then vote now. Now, talking of new music, we've got new music for you right now. This guy has sold over 30 million albums. He has a very famous dad, and he's following up his smash summer hit, Balamos, with this, a brand new single. It's called Rhythm Divine, and this is Mr. Enrique Iglesias. <laughs> This brilliant track is the second single from the Shorten's fifth album, Us and Us Only, which charted at number two in October. The lads are currently on a sellout tour of Japan, but we'll be back for more dates in the UK next year. Boy Wonder is 22-year-old Rob Webster, who progressed from raver to resident DJ at top UK club Progress. This single samples Madonna's number one hit, Papa Don't Preach, originally released in 1986. The guys from James were actually hypnotised for the making of this new video and suggestions were made earlier this year that the group were finished but they soon silenced their critics as Millionaires is now one of the best selling albums of 1999 And finally a treat for TLC fans. This is a sneak preview for the video to their new single, Dear Lie. US reports suggest that Left Eye has challenged her fellow band members to see who can record the best solo album next year. Well, good luck to you all, girls. Get out of my mouth. Get out of my head. Get out of my mind. Stop putting words in my head. You just clap it in me shot there. Cheers! Loads of future hits, which I'm sure you'll see on CDK in the next couple of weeks. Time now, though, to cut to the chase and find out who's in five to two. Mario Q and new at five, communication. Somebody answer the phone. You saw them earlier in the show. Every day I love you, falls to four for boys on. Still in the top three, Wandu Project's X Chart Topper, King of My Castle, falls one place. And new at two, Southampton based Artful Dodger, come close, but not close enough with Rewind. Well, Cliff Richard isn't at five, he's in at four, he's in at three, and he's definitely not at two, which can only mean one thing. Yes, he had his first hit in 1959. He's had hits in the 50s, in the 60s, in the 70s, in the 80s, and in the 90s. No. Last time he was number one was 1990 with Saviour's Day, and he's there again. So Cliff Richard is still the CDK Saturday chart. No one! Good old Cliff. Keep the applause going for Cliff Richard there. It's growing on me. Two weeks in a row, number on one. Me. Let's keep our fingers crossed for a third. That's yours, Cliff. That's yours. Come and get it. Well done, eh? I hope he makes it three in a row. Do you reckon two? I hope he makes it three so weeks in a row. Well done, my man. No, I do. Uh, who's the winner of the People's Choice? I can hear you cry. Only who, you know. Who is the I'm winner of the People's you. Choice? In third place, with 15% of your votes, is the solid gold chart buster. I'll do, I'll do it like Tarrant. In second place is Prince on 24%, but in first place, with a mass, massive 61% of your votes, it's the Bewitched Girls. They've won it this week. Well done, girls. We'll see you next week with the People's Choice winners, Bewitched, Indeed. S Club 7, and of course, the fantastic Macy Gray. Until next week, take care. We'll leave you with Bewitched. Bye! Bye! Bye.